Hello everybody and welcome to the video. In today's video, we're going to talk about how you can film great footage in harsh sunlight. From a lighting point of view, generally most filmmakers want to film at sunrise or at sunset because that's when the light is at its nicest. However, due to timings or budget constraints, sometimes we have to film during the middle of the day. Now, the lighting at that time isn't the best. It's often harsh and can create nasty shadows across the face, and it just isn't particularly visually pleasing. Now for high budget productions, often they can have big powerful HMI lights which can counteract that, or full rigs to diffuse the light. But for most of us, that isn't always accessible. So in this video, I'm gonna go through the best ways to diffuse the light on a budget. We're filming out in this work yard today, and the first thing to do is work out the position of the camera and also the position of the sun. It's just after 1 p.m. here, and the sunlight is coming in at a, a very slight angle. So what we're gonna do is position the talent facing into the sun at an angle themselves. This way we can shoot the camera into the shadow side of the face, creating as close to, or as possible as close to, the 45 degree lighting angle. For camera position, I'm gonna place the camera facing in towards the talent on the shadow side of the face. I'm also gonna use the leading lines in the back of the work yard to again direct the audience's eye towards the talent. In order to make the talent stand out a little bit more, I've also gone for a slightly lower angle looking up to create that larger than life look. Once we set our camera and the position of the talent, it's then time to diffuse the sun. Again, ideally you would have a bigger rig here with C-stands and full mounts of diffusion rigs. However, I feel this is a great little workaround on a budget. What I've got here is just a simple light stand, my super clamps onto a magic arm, and I've just taken the outer layer of the five-in-one diffusion and hung it up and found the right placement for it. Once you've got the right position, you should see that it easily softens the light and easily takes a stop or maybe even two off of the sun. Here is a shot before and after. In my opinion, I think this makes a huge difference. It's so simple to do and softens the shadows, softens the light and just makes it look so much more visually pleasing. That's it for today's video guys, thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next one, bye bye.